I came to WCA my sophomore year in high school. Um, I had a lot of issues from my past, a lot of hurts, a lot of things that made me feel discouraged. Um, it was life changing for me to be at WCA. My teachers um, poured the gospel message into me and it helped me turn around entirely, academically and spiritually. Um, it really planted a lot of seeds that have flourished into the person that I am today. Um, it is a blessing and a gift to be able to walk back now into WC as a teacher and to be able to pour into my own students and to share um, my faith with them, to share who Jesus is, to encourage them academically and to help them on their good days and their rough days um, and to let them know that they're not alone and that I'm here supporting them and encouraging them along the way. Uh, WCA has been like home to me. Um, they welcome me with open arms. Uh, my first year here, I remember that I was nervous and I was scared about meeting new people coming from public school. And so everyone just, they, they treated me as though I was family. And as you know, my last year here being a senior, I've met new people, I've built relationships with teachers, had prayer buddies I've become close with, and it's just been an amazing experience. My son has been diagnosed with, with autism. He's in the second grade, uh, but that diagnosis isn't limiting in any way here at WCA. In the three years he's been here, he has completely blossomed. Uh, his personality is showing uh, more and more every day. He's, he's learning at a rate that even astounds me. His grades are better than mine ever were, and uh, that's, that is a direct result of the, the hands-on, individualized learning that is stressed at WCA. I like going to praise and worship because I love singing to Jesus. My prayer buddy is really nice. Her name is Mandy, and I love playing games with her and praying with her. So I was at WCA uh, since I was in fourth grade. Um, I grew up in a Christian family, but uh, throughout WCA, I was really encouraged by my peers as well as my teachers to uh, pursue God on my own. Um, no one was going to hand you, uh, hand me Christianity and say, "All right, this is here. It is. Congratulations." Um, I really learned the, that it's a journey and that it's really um, what you put into it and God appreciates you back. And uh, that really, WCA planted a seed for me. And uh, when I got to college, I saw that seed really grow and uh, flourish um, with the people that I was hanging out with, um, the groups that I was able to be involved with, and uh, various uh, campus organizations and activities. And um, I can honestly say, uh, thanks to WCA playing the seed, um, I have grown leaps and bounds in my faith in college, and uh, I am grateful for it. Psalm 90 says, Lord, you have been our dwelling place in all generations. That's true, WCA has always lived in his love. We first came as a family to WCA in 1983 to enroll our oldest son in first grade. The building was rustic, but when we walked in, the Spirit of the Lord was clearly in that place and we signed him up. I joined the staff in 1987 and we moved to a beautiful new building that was associated with the church with which we were associated at the time. It was great until the church went bankrupt and then we were on the move again. We found a deserted building. It had been a school and had been deserted for three years. The first time we walked into it, it had so much mold and mildew 
that we were so discouraged, we went out the back door and looked at the trailer that we hoped to use as a classroom and found that it had a hole in the floor through which a weed was growing up the wall towards the hole in the roof so we could get the sun. We looked around in discouragement until the daughter of one of our staff members said, this is gonna be great when we fix it up. And it was, the Lord provided. When we are now in this beautiful building and we look around, one of the teachers that came to us this year for the first time said the building was beautiful, but when she walked in, the thing that hit her was the spirit of the Lord and his love was in this place. God is our dwelling place and has been for generations. And that's my WCA experience. And that's my. And that's my. And that's my. And that's my WCA experience. And that's my WCA experience. And that's my WCA experience.